Understanding Active Voice in English. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to dive into a fundamental concept in English grammar, the active voice. Understanding this will not only improve your writing but also make your communication clearer and more direct. So, let's get started. In the active voice, the subject of the sentence performs the action expressed by the verb. This structure makes it clear who or what is doing the action. For example, in the sentence, the cat chased the mouse, the cat is the subject and is actively doing the chasing. Active voice is straightforward and easy to understand, which is why it's often preferred in most forms of writing. To identify the active voice, look for a sentence structure where the subject comes before the action. The typical format is subject plus verb plus object. For instance, the teacher explains the lesson. Here, the teacher is the subject, explains is the verb, and the lesson is the object. The focus is on the doer of the action, the teacher. Using the active voice in your writing has several benefits. 1. Clarity and precision. It's clear who is performing the action. 2. Engagement. Active sentences are more engaging and dynamic. 3. Brevity. Active voice often leads to shorter, more concise sentences. It's important to distinguish active voice from passive voice. In passive voice, the subject is acted upon by the verb. For example, the mouse was chased by the cat. Notice how the focus shifts from the doer, the cat, to the receiver of the action, the mouse. While passive voice is useful in some contexts, active voice is generally more direct and impactful. Here are some quick tips to help you use active voice effectively. Start with the subject. Determine who or what is doing the action. Use strong verbs. Choose verbs that clearly convey the action. Keep it simple. Avoid unnecessary words that can clutter your sentence. That's a wrap on our exploration of active voice. Remember, using the active voice can make your sentences clearer and more engaging. We hope this video has been helpful in understanding and applying this important concept in English. Keep practicing, and see you in the next video.